Trump sure seems to mean what he says. More than anyone ever before him, at least. But look at this. Look at how he starts to explain how he's going to do it. But they all told me the same thing. They explained that the previous administration promised you a so-called midterm review of the federal fuel efficiency standards. It was necessary because the standards were set far into the future, way, way into the future. If the standards threatened auto jobs, then common sense changes could have and should have been made. Just days before my inauguration, the previous administration cut short the promised midterm review in an 11th hour executive action. Today, I am announcing that we are going to cancel that executive action. We are going to restore the originally scheduled midterm review, and we are going to ensure that any regulations we have protect and defend your jobs, your factories. We're going to be fair. We're going to be fair. I like that goatee guy. I bet, I bet you shake his hands. It feels like he could crack a walnut. But isn't Trump's speech interesting? It's not chauvinism or bigotry or sloganeering. It's actually a bit of a plan. He says the environmentalist regulations on U.S. cars are a major problem. It's a huge cost, obviously, for manufacturers and therefore for buyers. And Obama had made it worse. Trump isn't abandoning fuel efficiency standards altogether. He's just saying they're going to be reviewed, and they'll be fair and reasonable, and workers' jobs will count as much as the environmental lobbyists do. Did you hear the cheering?